This local sports report is presented by Nutra Farms, a proud supporter of the Collingwood Blues. Nutra Farms is the number one local supplier of free range and natural organic meats, customized and delivered direct to your door in southwestern Ontario. Quality, affordability, convenience. Check out NutraFarms.ca. Here come the defending champions for opening night in the OJHL season. The Collingwood Blues beginning defense of their Buckland Cup title on the road. They were facing the Brantford 99ers at the Gretzky Center. Opening period, here's the first goal of the new season, and it's a beauty. This is Landon Wright breaking in. He makes a move and opens the scoring. Nice work from Wright. He makes it 1-0 Collingwood, and the Blues looking for more. Callum Show is at the point. He shot tipped in front. Good stuff from Aiden. And Barry and he hangs on for a whistle. Barry keeps it one nothing. A few minutes later, here come the 99ers. Jack Panko with a centering pass. It goes to Evan Kojakaro and he scores. Bradford pulling even. We are tied at one after one. Second period, more pressure from the 99ers. Spencer Gendal setting it up for Mateo Crescegno and he rips it in. Bradford is their first lead of the night. Four minutes into the middle period. Then it's more from Aiden Barry. He makes a terrific stop on this play. Barry did not. Mark McIntosh point blank. It stays 2-1 for the 99ers. Just over a minute later, this is Nicholas Lamont with the puck. His shot is loose in the crease. Daniel Markevich is there to score. Big marker Markevich. It's 2-2 after 40 minutes. Back to the highlights in a minute. First, a reminder, this video is presented by Nutra Farms, a proud supporter of the Blues. Nutra Farms is your number one local supplier of free range and natural organic meats. Learn more at NutraFarms.ca. Third period, now it's a shorthanded chance for Brantford, but how about Noah Pack? He absolutely robs Cameron Kay, and that was huge because moments later, it's Spencer Young with a point shot, Jack Silverman with a tip in front. He gives Collingwood the lead, a big stop at one end, a goal at the other. It's 3-2 Blues and a little later, here is the dagger. Mark McIntosh wins the battle behind the net and he finds the captain. Dylan Hooden scores. He makes it 4-2 and that was the final on Thursday night. The Blues take their season opener on the road. Here is Dylan Hooden after the game. McIntosh got in on the puck there. Um, made, made a great play behind the net out front. Um, I was lucky to put it in and uh, yeah, we have great chemistry, I can't be happier to play with him. Obviously Pac's our rock back there, he's, uh, he's been our rock for forever now. Um, the young guys, they're all, they're all chipping away, they all look good, they're lots of speed, lots of skills, that's what our team's based on. A um, little bit of habits we got to work on, but other than that, uh, yeah, we look good. I definitely think there's a lot of positives to take away from it, moving into tomorrow in the game on Sunday, but uh, definitely some things we got to improve on. Um, but yeah, there's definitely lots of positives that we're bringing out, so I think that's going to be a good thing. We got the two points on the road, so we're just looking back, uh, going back to the Eddie Bush and get another two.